Hmm. There's a lot of pressure going on and it involves about either surrender or not. To reconcile or not, to make this decision or not, to move forward or not. This is about, you have this idea where if you're with someone, everything should be fine, but then you are confronted with the opposite. You're with someone and life became complicated. Yes. A lot of people think that relationship is a magic pill that being in one, because we see all this happy couple, um, which I see opposite because I deal with a lot of couple. So, um, you know, like it's the answer to anyone's solution. Well, you're with someone, aren't you happy? Right, it's connected. But you never ask someone, oh, where you're single, aren't you happy? It's always like, you're, you're happy, you should be happy, you're with someone. That's different for you. You now see in this situation where like, I can't do this because if I continue to do this, being vulnerable and open to you, the only thing I'm getting is hurt. Okay, Cancerian. So we're gonna go there. So this is your monthly. I do um, Sidera Astrology over here together with the Tarot and I have my crystal recommendation for you guys. Now, the crystal recommendation has a free class. It's down there. You can watch it for free on how to manifest. I'll, sh I'll share it more later. It's down there. You can, if you wanna jump, jump into it. You know, there's two things that I teach there. It's how to attract, you know, prosperity, abundance, you know, money, you know, your success. And also today is very spe special or this month is very special for you because this is your month, okay? It is officially the cancer season in Sidereal, which is the actual placement of the sun. Okay, so this is when the sun is really in cancer. Uh, you can see it in the, if you go and watch a telescope over there, it's in the constellation of cancer, okay? Now, okay, let's see here. Mm -hmm. You have your first card here as a judgment. This is your will, your courage to put things aside and then let's make a decision. Because you have here now, it's like, we need to do this now. So you have a judgment card. Your person, or the way that the situation is going right now, you got nine of wands here, and then the moon. Okay. I'm seeing right now that your person, I'm sorry, not your person, because this is, but because there's a darker side to this, and your person is not revealing to you, and then you got tired of it, because this is your card, okay. the moon, you're ruled by the moon. You feel like, why does it always have to be this difficult, okay? Like, when everything has to just flow, it goes opposite. Now, the moon is waxing and waning. The first, um, on August 1st, I believe it's a full moon. I, I don't have it here. I didn't open it. I have your chart. But that can be um, triggering, okay? The moon here is a card of, um, the way I see this is mirroring each other, okay? The moon is like, you change your mind, they change your mind, and then things become an issue between the two of you. It's a luminary. Now you do care for this person for sure. Mm -hmm. Right now, Okay, meaning I put the calendar over here for your, in August 15 already, okay? During the time, okay, there is a feeling of discomfort. Pearls are the only crystal grown from life itself. They represent beauty in its highest form and shine in the light. Pearls have always been associated with success, prosperity, and abundance. Now, 
you can experience the pearl's timeless beauty and attract success with our new pearl collection available now at eatreadlove.me. You're in the cutting phase here because you're finding out the truth about your person. And you have a foreign or a person far from you and then you're seeing them now. It's like, oh, so this is, so this is who you really are. Then you have a seven of wands, which only means that you're saying to your person that this cannot be, we cannot continue. Okay. The Queen of Swords and the Page of Swords, if you see this, you're distancing yourself. You want freedom because this is not helping you acquire stars or Leo or Scorpio. It's a breaking point for you for this month because when we have our solar return, it's actually a good time for us to look back and then reassess. Mercury is retrograde on the 23rd of August. Venus is, starts retrograde on June, well, July 23, all the way to September. We have three planets that are retrograde um, for the month of August, Saturn, Mercury, and Venus. For you and for everyone, of course, that can bring a lot of different issues. That can bring issues for you with regards to your Ashtama Shani, which means Ashtama is 8, Saturn is in the 8th house. Looking at your relationship in the 7th, that, you know, because it's in retrograde, Saturn rules that. That's the feeling of the hardship that you're putting in right now. And as much as I would like to, you know, tell you like, oh, a wonderful life and time is going to be amazing. Saturn sits in a zodiac and everyone experiences, not just you. Um, Saturn sits here for two and a half years. It's been there this year. So there's going to be two more years where you may be feeling this and you're, it's reality. Okay. Our life is, uh, is, you know, it always evolves. So you may feel like right now, but it's always going to go up. Right? Mm -hmm. But right now, we brace ourselves for the challenges because it's, it's creating such a big impact in your life. Ten of Cups, see? It can go up. It can be good. Mm. Mm. It can be good for once. It can be good if your person is committed to you because you're committed to them. You have a Ten of Cups and the Four of Wands. So you care, you love, you give. Now, during this time, if you're trying to bring in stability to your life, especially you, you're ruled by the moon. These are freshwater pearls. Okay, you can check it out. These are fortune pearls, though, okay? Because um, it's a fortune here. You can check it out. We ship international. And then, like what I mentioned, how to use the, the Piao, the real gold Piao is down there in the description box below. You can check it, check it out at our website, eatreadlove.me also. Um, and we have different sizes. Now, Pearl is connected to the moon. I explained in a whole video, especially you, Cancer, and you need to watch that because this is your gemstone. Okay? Pearl is your gemstone. So at least once in your life, you learn about yourself and why, ge why this gemstone is important to you. Okay? But if you know yourself already, then you don't need to because this actually helps you be, well, one, fulfilled, as you, okay, I use different gemstones. This is our store. Uh, I have this store for like almost four years now. This is our third and going in our fourth. Um, Pearl brings security to you, especially when you make this decision, okay, about the relationship. Because there has been, there's three queens over here, which only means you're trying to settle with someone who probably wasn't as honest as you would like to think. Okay. Let's see. Let me see your person here. Okay. Well, they're not opening up, that's for sure, and very secretive. They're holding back. You have Four of Pentacles and the High Priestess, definitely holding back. 
They have all these things that they're thinking about, but they won't let you in. So it's very complicated okay. with your person. And it involves about the relationship and how much they feel for you. They have justice and a ten of cups. But this is not a person who's like, oh, they're in love with you. They're having some pros and cons, some doubts or questioning. You know, They're trying to understand. Okay. You have a ten of cups and the justice card, eight of swords, and the nine of pentacles. Your person is going through some sort of big que like questioning. Okay? So you may have the chart, but they're part of your life, so it's actually them causing this problem, right? Because seventh house is others. Okay? Saturn looks into the seventh for you. Venus is retrograde. Okay? Venus Shlesha, looking at you also. Because it's in Cancer, Leo Cancer. So you're in this, so like, should I work this? And if it's going to work, will it? You know? Your person right now, there's so many things. Eight of Swords, doubt, fears, you know, going, going deep inside their head about this, this connection. Both of you are confident, though, Nine of Pentacles, about your, your daily life. Your daily life is amazing. Nothing has changed here. But this relationship, okay, is definitely going through its hardship. Now, your person is about to make this decision. And this decision, I will continue in the extended. Link in the description box below for the extended reading. Or you can click at the corner of this video if you would like to see what happens next. Make sure to visit our website, eatreadlove.me, for our wonderful pearl collection together with the PL. Check it out. And we ship international. Other than that, I'll see you in your extended.